Hi. How are you guys doing? Um, my name is Robin. I'm in Fleet Foxes. Thank you so much for being here. Um, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> um, I just want to quickly come out and say, yeah, thank you so much for being here. Thank you to this beautiful pavilion for having us. I'm so glad we get to like smell the sea air while we play. It's going to be great. Um, I also wanted to say that we've just been having the best time on this tour. I don't really want it to end somehow. <laughs> um, and one reason this tour has been such a blast is because we've been uh, super lucky to be traveling with our opening act, Uwa Day, who's just... Um, and I, I know you'll love her as much as we do. So without further ado, thank you so much for being here, and I present to you Uwa Day. Boston, how's everyone doing tonight? Good, good, good. Thank you so much to Robin and Fleet Foxes for having me. Um, this has been the best experience ever, uh, my second tour ever, and like I wouldn't trade this opportunity for the world. So thank you all so much for being here as well. Big round of applause for you. Um, so I'm going to sing a few songs for you tonight, if that's okay. Oh, thank you. Good. Uh, so, this first song is called Nostalgia, and it's the first song I ever released. It's my baby, and it came after I had like my 15 minutes of fame in 2019 when this band I love, Wolfpack, reposted a cover of me on their page. And I was like, you know, where's my Grammy, you know, Recording Academy, I hope you're, you're watching. Um, so I released this song, and it's called Nostalgia, and I hope you enjoy it. Thought you'd be Maybe one 
Honestly, every time Robin introduces me and he's like, oh, she is like one of the best singing voices. I'm like, damn, now I got to go out there and sound good. But thank you all so much. Um, I really appreciate it. Uh, so this next song, um, if you're not from southeastern Nigeria and you don't know what the name Uade means, it means wealth is coming. Um, and my dad named me. And I always joke, he was a very funny man. I always joke that he, you know, to name your child, wealth is coming, you had to have been in like a really bad debt situation when they were born, because I don't see why else that would be your kid's name, but um, I appreciate it. Uh, and he also thought of himself as a sort of prophet, which is super cool and humble. Um, and he liked to call himself the man who sees tomorrow. Um, and he's, you know, he was a role model for me. And so when he passed away two years ago, I wrote this next song for him. Um, and it's called The Man Who Sees Tomorrow. And I hope you enjoy it.
Thank you. Thank you so much. Does anyone here like the band Sylvanesso by any chance? Cool, love them. Um, well, this next song is the last song I released. Um, actually, no, it's not. But it's one of the last songs I released. It came out in January of this year. And I was lucky enough to release it on Sylvanesso's new label, Psychic Hotline, which is super cool. They're amazing. Um, and because they're so cool and amazing, they released the merch for the song as a cassette. And I don't have a cassette player. But if you do, I would love to listen to it with you in its pure form. Um, but for now, I can just sing it. And it's called Do You See the Light Around Me? And I hope you enjoy it. Do you see the light around me? Well, I don't see the light around me most days. Do you see the good about me? about it anyways I spend my waking hours dreaming of your honey eyes none of this is in my power should I even tell you all the time I'd spend by your side see yourself clearer I don't even think we need the sunlight don't bring anybody else near us if I could I'd drown them out I'd spend my waking hours swimming in your honey eyes wasting days 